hi guys welcome to my channel okay so i posted a video a vlog actually my last post and um, i got a lot of reviews a lot of comments good ones actually so a lot of people were asking how i was able to package such a nice interesting vlog and so i decided okay why not just make a video telling people teaching people on how to make create a very interesting vlog which is why I am making this video today so if you are a content creator or you're a vlogger get in here this video is for you i'm going to be sharing 10 tips on how to create a very interesting vlog okay so before i get into it i just want to say thank you thank you to all my hundred and what's hundred and oh my god I, I can't even believe it i mean i'm barely um okay, i'm barely three weeks and i have over 100 subscribers whoosh thank you guys i do not take you for granted okay so i just want to say thank you keep liking keep watching videos keep sharing and if you're new here you're just joining this family please don't forget to hit the subscription button okay subscribe like this video and share okay leave your comments and i will just leave a comment say i subscribe and i'll make sure to give you a thumbs up in the comment section okay all right so let's get to it all right guys so before i move on i would make reference to that vlog the last video i posted if you haven't seen it please go watch that video i promise you it's interesting it's an interesting vlog so i'm leaving the link in the description below hit on that link and just go watch the video and leave your comments okay all right so let's get into it now first of all i would like you to understand the an this analogy i want to give an analogy right concerning content yes we all know that content what content means i mean literally what does content mean it means satisfaction right so you need to have this at the back of your mind when you're putting out your content your audience needs to be satisfied with whatever it is that you're putting out there whichever genre of content that you're putting out you need to know that you, your goal should be your end goal should be satisfaction to your audience so let me give let me give an illustration you have a bottle right it's an empty bottle now this is a bottle but it's empty meaning it has no content in it right and then you have another bottle that is filled with water right so these are two bottles except that there's a difference one has content and the other one has no content so one has no value and the other one has value now the empty bottle is useless to you so you just do what you, you fling it right now but this other bottle that has water it has something to offer and then you can easily just take water a cup of water a glass of water from this bottle and then you drink and then you what you're what you're satisfied right so it gives you satisfaction it gives you content it has content in it which is the water the other bottle has no content yeah, so, so this is the analogy I would like you to have at the back of your mind whenever you decide to create content. Whatever type of content that it is you want to create, you need to know that your audience must be satisfied watching your content, okay? Hi, my lovelies. My name is Gucci. Thank you for stopping by this channel today. In this channel, I post content creation ideas and tips. I post interesting stories and I also share faith-based experiences. I also post lots of vlogs and lifestyle videos. Please stay with me on this video today. I promise you won't regret it. Don't forget to subscribe and like if you haven't. So let's get into it. 10 tips on how to create a very interesting vlog. Number one is storytelling. So you need to you need to master the arts of storytelling. Tell a story with your vlog okay so you don't just go about creating vlog just because you want to create a vlog because of course everyone is doing it you should have a story at the back of your mind and your audience needs to follow that story from the beginning of that vlog to the end and guess what they need to be satisfied like okay hmm right so that's number one tip storytelling okay now number two is planning your filming you need to plan your filming okay um, especially if you have a story to tell at the back of your mind with your vlog, then you know you need to come up with a plan on how to film. Whichever type of vlog you are, you're creating, even if, even if it's um, 
a compilation of your activities of different um in different days of the week or different week or different months and you're trying to just put them together to create one vlog then you also have to plan the filming as well okay so um plan your filming and um so that you can be able to come up with a very good comprehensive story at the end of your vlog three is you need to take unique angles and shots that makes your video really really spicy i don't know how to explain this i mean these days you can you can just get creative on how uh, on the way you you do your filming you could go from up to down or from from down to up or you know or you can just zoom in and zoom out and then take them in very nice unique corners like unique angles all right so number four tip is to take quick cuts okay so um in as much as you have to film with style and take unique um shots and angles you have to be as quick as possible like take quick cuts okay so that helps you i mean it, it helps you to like really define your filming define even during editing that's very very useful okay so take quick cuts while filming so let's go to the next tip follow a sequence of editing which brings me to number two where i said plan your filming so now if you plan your filming it helps you at this point where you want to edit you need to follow a sequence of editing you don't just take footages and just put them together anywhere on your timeline no that's going to mess up it's going to mess up the whole vlog so you need to follow a sequence of editing and if you plan your filming this becomes really easy so you have to follow a sequence of editing especially knowing that you have a story to tell so everything has to go sequentially all right so tip number six use sound effects very necessary if you want your vlog of your video to be interesting you need to learn the art of using sound effects okay so that's very necessary depending on what part of your um, video you're recording that you're editing at that point in time you need to look out for um environmental you know features that could need that would need you to add a sound effect so use sound effects now tip number seven use transitions effect where necessary for instance you making you're compiling um videos or recordings or filmings that you've done from several weeks or several days and you just want to put them together to make up a vlog then it's very necessary that you use transition effects okay so use transition effects where necessary it makes it i mean it just makes it really interesting like your audience follows through like you know oh this is the next stage you're talking about this is the next part of the story you know so it just takes them along it feels like a, a ride right so i always try to use transition effects where necessary so tip number eight you need to add comics it's very necessary today everybody just i mean in the world today everyone just wants to be happy they want to laugh they want to find reasons to smile so in the middle of everything just try to add comics it could be a video of you maybe an uh an extra video of you maybe doing something goofy or you could just use emojis you could use gifs just anything you know to just give it a funny you know that funny vibe and all of that okay so that takes me to tip number nine which is use explanatory text right so sometimes in your vlog there are parts where you know you might lose your audience if you do not put in um the effort to like explain what is going on at that point in time using text okay so so there, there are points where or there might be a clip where the activities might be just too much too busy and your your audience is struggling to follow in clips like that you need to use explanatory text to describe um items describe events going on the activity going on and all of that so yeah you need to introduce that to your vlog okay so now the last tip is music music is a very essential part it plays a key role in your vlog now what you need to understand is that you don't just use any type of sound or music for your vlog so your music has to connect 
with your vlog with the activity with the team of that vlog right for instance in the vlog i posted it was a fashion event right and i had to use a french music so it's blended with the event and i mean i got comments like oh the music everything was just so perfect that's because i took my time to research so you need to you can dedicate five minutes to researching for the type of music to use for your video for your vlog okay so you don't just put out any kind of music there you just bore out your viewers okay you have to put something really interesting like even when they are starting to get bored with the visuals the music keeps them glued to the video you, you know i mean you get what i'm saying <laughs> okay guys so that's 10 tips on how to create a very interesting vlog please do not forget to go check out my vlog the description the link is on the description below description box below so please go and check it out leave your comments there thank you for staying with me on this video if you are a new person here please subscribe like and comment and if you are already a, a subscriber and you're here watching this video please don't forget to hit the like button okay and leave your comments i would make sure to respond to your comments thank you guys for staying with me in this video see you in my next video Bye.